Thank you, Ron. Time now to open this stacked and historic card. Heavyweight tournament quarterfinal number one, Arnold A.J. Adams versus D.J. Linderman. Antonio, we see our tail of the tape. Yeah, pretty much even fight. You got two inches uh, for Arnold, for Adams right here. That's about it. And the age is right there, right with each other. But look at the 78 reach. If he can stay outside and use that reach, it could be to his advantage tonight. Tonight's fight for Bare Knuckle Fighting Championship are under the auspices and control of the Wyoming Mixed Martial Arts and Combative Sports Commission. All fights scheduled for five two-minute rounds this evening. Three judges scoring on a 10-point must system. No three dot down rule, no standing eight. Hand wraps must be at least one inch below the knuckles. Punching champ in the clinch is allowed. And that's going to be very important because a lot of times when you're boxing, as soon as you clinch, they break it up. But not tonight. They can fight. Time now to make history. We go to our outstanding ring announcer in the squared circle. Here is Jeff Houston. Good evening and hello, Cheyenne. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Cheyenne Ice and Event Center. Welcome to history in the making, as each and every one of you are the envy of the fighting world here tonight. And welcome to Bare Knuckle Fighting Championship. We are live worldwide. And ladies and gentlemen, we are ready to get this party started. So first, we would like to go ahead and introduce our judges who will be officiating tonight's event. Josh Johnson. Janelle Melesh, Kevin Champion, and Tom Gilogli, and our referees assigned to our chaos inside the squared circle, Dan Bergliata and Bill Clancy. And now, ladies and gentlemen, live worldwide on pay-per-view, if you are ready, it's time to knock off! We are set for our first fight of the night, and it is scheduled for five two-minute rounds, and it is a heavyweight tournament quarterfinal fight number one. Introducing to you first, fighting out of the red corner. Tonight, he is wearing pink and red, trimmed in black. His official weight, 261.6 pounds. He stands six feet, one inch tall. His MMA record consists of 21 victories opposite 14 defeats, with six big wins coming by way of knockout. He fights out of Wairika, California. Here is DJ, the protege, Linderman. And across the squared circle, his opponent fighting out of the blue corner. Tonight, he is wearing black, trimmed in gold. He stands six feet, three inches tall. His official weight, 255.6 pounds. He is an MMA veteran of 17 professional fights. Fighting out of the Windy City, Chicago, Illinois. Please welcome A.J. Bomaye Adams. And our referee in charge of the action, Big Dan Mergliata. Okay, corners out. The first fully recognized bare knuckle fight in the United States since 1889, and the first legal, sanctioned, and regulated right, bare knuckle fight ever. Up the scratch for Adams and Linderman as they tow the line and knuckle up. The bell in round number one. Black trunks for Arnold A.J. Adams, pink and red trunks for D.J. Linderman. Right hand from Adams. See the lateral movement, stiff jab from Adams. Linderman trying to find his way to the inside. Right hand, right hand, Didn't think they would come out as technical as, as both guys has. There's the dirty boxing, big uppercut in the clinch. Simultaneous jab, smile on the face of DJ Linderman. Good left hand from Linderman. And a smile from Adams right back. Wide open guard champ for Adams. Yeah, he's relaxing there. He's moving, but he's, ooh, just threw a beautiful right hand. He's gonna have to get that front, that front hand moving though. There you go. You wanna stick that jab just to keep him at bay. One minute remaining, round number oh. one. 
that is ruled a knockdown by Dan Mergliotta. And that was a short jab. You don't, it don't take much if you land solid with no gloves on. Hands up. You ready to go? Okay, ready. We fight on. Linderman ready to go. We'll see if Adams pounces. These two-minute rounds will absolutely fly by. No, Adams looked like a control fighter. He's using his technique right now. Like I said, that jab is very important. Adam said, I have unusual and even exceptional speed for a heavyweight in combat sports. Linderman again to the inside. Linderman said of Adams, he's not explosive. If this goes past two rounds, he will absolutely gas out. Abrasion under the left eye of Linderman. Good stiff jab from Adams. Final seconds, round number one. Look like a little cut on Linderman's uh, left eye. He's blinking and rubbing it. Morning for Mergliata. That mouse has popped in the end of round number one. We are so pleased that you're with us watching live in the U.S., Canada, and around the world. History being made, BKFC, the beginning. Right here, you see, it's just a quick, and he just turned that left hand over, that lead hand. Caught him right on the button, right below the nose, right there. Very competitive first round. That, of course, is the voice of the great Antonio Tarver. Mason the line, Dixon for Rocky Balboa. <laughs> Five time to division boxing world champion. Brock is with us. Jeff Houston is our ring announcer. I'm Sean Wheelock. That is a nasty mouse that has popped in round number one under the eye of Bellator veteran DJ Linderman. 21 pro career MMA wins for Linderman. He's also fought five times as a professional boxer. Steps in with that left. And that's what he needs to do. Keep that pressure on him. Because when he, he got some good work inside like he's getting, he's doing now. That looked like a little elbow then. Smart with the head movement. You see the pivot, not a butt, but legal. And there's the fighting from the clinch. As long as they don't clinch with both hands, it's all legal. And backing out. The separation, the restart from Dan Mergliotta. Truly one of the best referees in all of combat sports. Linderman got to get some head movement because that front hand is eating him alive right now. There. Linderman also cut now between his eyes, so two different cuts. Ooh. As he eats that uppercut with the right hand from Adams on his face. Nearly an elbow from Linderman, that is not allowed. Punches only. Break, please. To the body. Take him over and look at the doctor right now. Time called, round number two. And tonight's fight under the auspices and control of the Wyoming Mixed Martial Arts Combatant Sports Commission, putting a premium on safety. Two cage side physicians in attendance. Two outstanding cut men. Bill Smith, Stitch Duran, the other cut man on this show. The amusement on the face of Arnold A.J. Adams. Well, that's something you probably won't see in boxing, where you got the cut man <laughs> doing some cut work while he's watching, while he's uh, going to be reviewed by the doctor. This is a good chance for him to get a second win and might keep himself in this fight just a little bit longer. Time in, round number two resumes. Immediately, Linderman on the resumption turns up the volume. That's where he's done most of his good work inside. Hard left hands from Linderman. There's the separation from Adams. Instead of Linderman, his only asset as a fighter is experience. AJ Adams supremely confident entering this bout. It looks like he's the most experienced guy because Nice right hand. It looks like his, his poise right now sticks out. Even though he's in a bare knuckle fight, he seemed to be poised beyond his experience. He left hook from Linderman, misses badly. Linderman in MMA, known for a very good left hook. Final seconds, round number two. Arnold Adams feeling very good about things here in Cheyenne, Wyoming. He can't see out of that. I don't think he can see out of that left eye. It's closing. Rapidly. Jay Linderman, as you see, standing 
his red corner. And the mouse that popped under the left eye, and then around number two, the cut between the eyes is really a slice between the eyebrows, bridge of the nose. Uppercut. Good head move by Adams also. I mean, you would think a guy would be. The fight has been stopped, and that is it. Whoa. <laughs> so Arnold A.J. Adams, at 32 years old, the veteran of 17 career pro MMA fights, now claims victory in the first legal sanctioned and regulated bare knuckle fight ever. Smile on the face of Adams. Arnold Adams said, DJ Linderman will be stepping into the dark and I have night vision goggles. <laughs> He's supremely confident. That was an outstanding performance in victory. There's the show of respect between these two fighters. Sale from DJ Linderman, and again, you see those two nasty cuts. Champ, I think it was just the length of Arnold A.J. Adams throughout that fight. With that, too, and again, like I said, he was poised, he was under control, he knew exactly what he wanted to do, and he got it done tonight. He moves on, and I'm telling you, I think he moves up in the ring for his favorite to win this tournament because it's gonna take a good fighter to get him out of that comfort zone. This was heavyweight tournament quarterfinal number one. Next stop for Adams, the semifinal round later this year. Let's go to Jeff Houston. Hey, all you heavyweights back there, pay attention, take notes. Ladies and gentlemen, our ringside doctor has called a stop to this bout at the end of round number two. For your winner, by way of doctor stoppage, AJ Balmaye Adams! Officially goes down as TKO due to doctor stoppage. Four minutes, two minutes of round number two. Four minutes into this fight, DJ Linderman wanted to continue. The Wyoming Commission ringside physician feeling otherwise stopping this fight. And again, truly, this is a brutal sport, but yes, it is sir. safety first. Yeah, and you know, like I said, what a way to start tonight's uh, championship fights with, with that great contest right there. And I said again earlier, he's gonna be in better shape the next time because he knows what he's facing. He's gonna have a date, he's gonna have to get ready. He's gonna be someone to really reckon with in this tournament.